Hi soldiers, with the recent update from Opera GX browser, we are now unable to play the game on the said browser. When you try to play the game, you will be encountering the error, Adobe Flash Player is no longer supported. This was applied on their update 75.0. However, there is a good news. You can still play the game using Opera GX browser by downloading and installing a version 73.0. In order to do that, we first have to uninstall Opera GX on our system. You can do this by opening your windows and then typing control panel. And then you will see this tab. Players may see this, this, or this. In order to have the same screen as me, or the same layout of the control panel as me, you have to click category. And then hover over here, you will see uninstall a program. Click on that, and then find Opera GX in the list. Here, I can see Opera GX table. Right click on that, and click uninstall. Then you may want to delete my upper user data. Click uninstall. Yes. Then after it is uninstalled, you want to download the file of 73.0 upper GX. It is in the description down below. You can download it there. As you can see, I have already downloaded the Opera GX version 73.0. The next thing that we want to do is to disable our connection with the internet. Since if we try to install this version 73.0, it will automatically download and install version 75.0. We specifically want 73.0 since it still can run Adobe Flash Player. So to disable our internet connection, just hover over here on the monitor like icon, right click on that, open network and internet settings, and then you want to click on the internet. After clicking on the internet, you will see a change adapter options here, click on that, and then you will see a lot of, you may see a lot of options here. For me, it's only one. And then you click disable this network device. With that, I am no longer connected to the internet. And then we want to run the installer for Opera GX 73.0. Click run. Then you click install. As you can see it is now installed but don't connect your computer back to the internet just yet you want to open your Explorer tab you can simply click the Windows key and E on your keyboard at the same time to open this tab now you want to go to this PC find local DC or your default storage device for me it's local DC and then hover to users then after that, you will see user here. However, it may vary from user to user. If you change your user name on your Windows, you will see a different name. For example, I change my user name to Galaxy. It will appear as Galaxy here. However, I did not change my username, so it is still user. Click on that, and then you will have to find app data. However, you can see that the app data's opacity or transparency is not full. That means it is a hidden folder. In case that you don't see the folder named app data, you want to click view and then hidden items. Notice if I unclick the hidden items, the app data would disappear. So in order for you to see app data in case you don't see it is to check the hidden items. Then open app data. Go to local, 
find the folder name programs and then click upper GX then you want to open the folder name 73.0 the one with the underscore zero on the end open that you'll see a file application named update here something similar but it's not exactly update what you want to do is to change that to a random name and then what this does is to prevent upper GX from automatically updating itself if you did not change that app name application name or software name upper GX will automatically update to 75.0 which will prevent us from playing the game through Upper GX. After changing the application name, now what we should do is to connect back our computer to the internet. In order to do that, it has a very similar step in disabling our internet. You want to hover over here on the globe icon and then open network and internet settings. Then you won't see Ethernet here anymore. What you want to do is change adapter options. And then click on the Ethernet. Or you may see a different name there. Just enable this connect network device. As you can see, it is now enabled. Close that. Close this. I am now connected to the Internet. Let's see if it will automatically update. Let's now wait for a while. As you can see, an error occurred while checking for updates. That is because we changed the application name of the auto update application that Opera GX uses earlier in the app data folder. Now we want to go to our site, which is dtdn. 70games.com Want to log in our account? We want to log in our account and then go to any servers of your choice. For me, it's server 6 Manila. You won't be seeing the Adobe Flash Player is no longer supported anymore. You will see Adobe Flash Player is blocked, which is what we want to see. And then if you hover to the top right corner of your screen, you will see this icon here. Click on that, Manage Flash Settings. And then you want to click Ask First. If you hover back to, your, to the Game tab, you will see Click to Enable Adobe Flash Player. Click on that left click and then click allow then it will ask you to reload the page reload the page and then you will see Adobe Flash Player is out of date you want to right click on that and click run this plugin As you can see, the game is now loading. It should load perfectly and you will be able to play perfectly. A few notice before this video ends. You have to install an old version of Adobe Flash Player, which is Adobe Flash Player version 32. We have released a past tutorial on how to install Adobe Flash Player version 32. You can see the link for the video tutorial that we released on March 31, 2021. There is a link on the said video tutorial for the Adobe Flash Player version 32. You have to follow the instructions and tutorial on how to install Adobe Flash Player 32 before proceeding with this tutorial. In case you haven't installed Adobe Flash Player 32, I recommend that you install it first and watch the previous video that we posted. That is all. Thank you very much and have a great day.